I want to help you save money on your next hotel. Let's go. First, visit TripAdvisor.com and type in the city you want to visit. In this case, we'll go to Orlando. Then click the Hotels button, punch in the dates you want to travel, and check out the dates in yellow here because those are going to be the cheapest trips. Scroll to the left-hand side and choose the resort that fits your trip's needs. TripAdvisor is going to narrow down that list of hotels. In this case, let's check out the Holiday Inn. It gets five bubbles. That's really good. From there, it's going to show you the price of that hotel per night on all of these different travel sites. In this case, 123 bucks is a pretty good deal and about $30 off the regular price. But we can go a step further. Let's say, for example, I'm a frequent user of the Orbitz website. If you visit retailmenot.com and you type in Orbitz, it's gonna give you coupon codes that allow you to save even more. In this case, an extra 15% off. But the power of TripAdvisor doesn't stop there. It's also a great way to find things to do on your trip. Just click the things to do button. Scroll down and you'll see the top attractions in the city that you want to visit. And if you need a vehicle for your trip, which can be a challenge right now, try this trick. Visit Priceline.com, click on the Cars button, and tell it the city you're going to. Give it the exact times of your trip and hit Find Your Car. Priceline's going to check all of the major car companies and find you the cheapest rate. If you want something a little bit different, much like searching for a hotel, you can also specify the type of car you want or how much money you want to spend. For more tips on how to plan your next vacation and really cheap airfare, go to cvgairport.com slash jetwithjay.